Welcome to my crib. <laughs> Over here we have bedroom number one. Over there is bedroom number two. This is the dining room. This is where the magic happens. <laughs> So we started today off by getting stuck in the snow. Yeah, We're slowly making progress here. We're getting there. Oh, oh okay. you're out. Okay. Hey, man, hey. <sighs> We're almost there. I don't want to go down now, though. No. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Okay. I think we're okay, especially if we stick to the edge. Sometimes the edge is the weakest. Deep. There you go. that cable over there too. Where the ice is. Yeah. It's still to the other side. <laughs> uh, the, the bear site. I used up all that firewood. <sighs> okay. I gotta change. I am soaked. Luckily, I brought a change of stuff. So I gotta we'll get a fire going, get this jacket dried out. This jacket is soaked through and through. Okay. Like, <laughs> this is bad. This is not what you want when you're out here. Okay. Well, we got some, uh, is it chaga? So we got fire starter, we got tea, we got a coffee, we got, you know, you name it. It's all right here. In this rock hard solid mass. So, uh, yeah. Let's get a fire going. Right. The hardest thing right now is finding firewood. I think I found a dead tree over here. I'm gonna to try to take that down. We'll see. We just need enough wood to last us through the night, hopefully. Kevin's uh, working on building a snow fort to sleep in tonight. Um, it's actually not too bad out right now. I'm actually surprisingly warm. So I'll change after I do this. I don't know. Work up a sweat and another another pair of clothes. So let's keep going. So far, so so good. Let's see if we can make this TP work. So our, uh, our our tarp wasn't as big as we thought it was, but it's not the size of the tarp; it's how you use it. And I don't think we're using it very well. <laughs> A little bit of <clears throat> tree sap inside the chaga, and uh, you get that going nice. This should start my fire nicely. Following an animal trail. It's hard to tell what that is. 
it's like a fox, I don't know, maybe. And uh, yeah, big shout out to the Wooded Beardsman and Epic Provisions for the, the contest they did recently. Uh, yeah, so we got uh, Epic Bar. It's 100% natural chicken. Uh, you, natural chicken used, uh, chicken sriracha. 13 grams of protein, gluten-free. So, <laughs> so yeah, let's, let's open this bar up. It's a bit salty, but I guess after sweating while you're walking out here. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, this is sweet, look at this dude. <laughs> Whoa, look at that thing. Oh, don't do that. That might kill us. We get stabbed and there'd be no murder weapon. Okay. Slippery, eh? Yeah. I want to like take that big one down. <laughs> Nature's popsicle. Poopsicle. <laughs> Not sure if the camera's gonna focus on these little guys. These are all little bugs. And they're all jumping everywhere. Like snow fleas. Holy crap, they're everywhere, dude. Sausages and Kevin's got his. Uh, oh, yeah, spicy sausage pasta. Look at that, hey. Would you look at that? Pardon? This is the first sock change of the day. Mm. Oh, my yeah. Here you go. In the forest is very sun picking. Oh, well, we tried. <laughs> mm.
Seems a lot steeper in the winter. <laughs> so down there's our camp. <clears throat> Beautiful day for this. Shit, aren't you? <laughs> I was filming just in case. So much higher. Yeah. Well, it feels like it's longer down there. Busting now? Yeah. Now I roll. The cook too. Probably fucking sand fleas. No. <laughs> <laughs> Graceful as a gazelle. Does <laughs> that feel any day? Dead branches we can use. A knife. It's not a knife. Oh, uh, you you okay? Yeah, yeah. You gonna live? That's a fair sized deer going that way. It's really fresh too. That's a Kevin in the wild. So we thought we could take a shortcut back to our camp. Um, nope. <laughs> uh, and that's the thing. You might think it's a short walk, but in this country, it is all up and down, up and down, mountains and hills and <laughs> trees and cabins. These are great finds. See this? This is a dead birch tree. So because it's dead, it's just all hanging there. This is great fire starter. So I'm going to take a whole bunch of this stuff. So there we go. We got a... Looks like a cat print. Like, uh, it's hard to tell. Could just be a coyote. Probably a lynx, though. Uh, I have to look it up when I get, get out of here. Uh, it's not the greatest print. But, uh, yeah. See, see where our tracks have been. Oh, there's a, there's a pretty good one. It's like, there's my boot. There's the print. So, yeah. Got yeah. a big dead branch right here. I'm gonna work on it. It's off. Yeah, I don't know. That's weird. <laughs> you to get a soaker. Not that deep, don't worry. <laughs> enough to get even a soaker, enough to end the day.
hot. It's definitely hot now. We got our uh, venison steaks. Some nice deer steaks, courtesy of my uh, my uh, cousin Carl. And that's what... Whoa! Turns out it was four uh, little steaks. <laughs> Thought it was two, two steaks. These won't take long at all. That was a mistake. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Full of dad jokes today. <laughs> Ouch. Look at the duck fat. The duck fat gets really hot. Oh, yeah. That is good. I think I have, I have my, uh, my track pants kind of as a pillow inside here. I can still do this. I have my two in here too, but I got too warm. So actually I actually had to take my two cut off, which, you know, normally you don't do that. It's cool. <laughs> Time to hike out. <sighs> Gonna fall. <laughs> Well, he's not going anywhere anytime soon. Well then. People are like parking on the road to go camping. I could see that pissing them off for sure. 